Hey fellow Megamars, uh, Justin Raleigh here with Ratchet Effects. Hey, I'm trying to figure out a, uh, a new, safe, easy to clean, easy to disinfect solution uh, for an onset makeup kit. Something that could be used for, um, for one, you know, one actor on set. For the most part, they do make bigger versions of this, but right now this is just set up for one. And uh, sorry about the mask. I'm in my studio right now, and everyone is required to wear a mask. Uh, it's part of our little sticker here too. It shows that we went through our morning check-in process. So, anyways, this is the case that I'm looking at right now. This is a 13 quart Ingle cooler. This is a basic, you know, beer, wine, soda sort of cooler, uh, but it's all plastic. Interior is all plastic. It's easy to spray down completely. It does come with a strap, which you can easily take off to, uh, to wash and disinfect. But here's the basic look. Uh, this is a work in progress. Um, so please bear in mind that I'm just kind of taking components that I found on Amazon and other places and tried to modify my normal set bag into something that um, is sort of easy to use for one actor. So let's take a look inside. So uh, flip top case, I'm thinking about adding a couple little adhesive magnets on here and having maybe, uh, you know, maybe my tissue, individual tissues could get magnetized on top of here with a little uh, magnetic sticker that would go on there. But the, uh, the great thing about this case is you can easily fit pallets into it and it's got a good height. Uh, it's almost, uh, I would say, a little shorter than a beer bottle sort of height. Uh, so you can get a full-size pallet and quite a few other things. It does come with a little uh, removable tray. Nice thing about this is you can fit like a two ounce Telesis type bottle in here. I've got my sanitizer in here. I've got powder in here. I've got individual use uh, Kleenex in here, CC cups that are in a Ziploc bag. So that can be removable. Uh, I've also started looking at some Tupperware type containers that I can keep some product in, that I can have labeled. Again, something easy to take apart and disinfect and clean. I've also uh, found some of these great little art bins online that I can keep all my brushes in or the brushes that I'm specific specifically using for that actor can go in here. So all of their dedicated brushes can be in one little bin. It can also be used for like lip liners or similar, or even, um, even tools could go in here. Any metal tools could go into one of these. I've got some gloves that I've put in here. Again, I'm trying to find another solution for gloves and, and Kleenex. Uh, maybe there's uh, an additional little bin that I add to this or something like that. But again, this is something I can just use the gloves I need. I can easily dispose of this um, and put a new one in the next day where it's needed. But with one in here, you can actually, you know, you can fit. I've got an Evo uh, uh, e uh, EVA palette that can fit inside here. I've got some uh, eyeshadow palettes that could go in here. You know, your standard sort of tattoo size palettes will easily be able to fit inside here. A little RCMA palette can fit in here. We've got one of the little MYO palettes. You know, this one hasn't been set up, but these are great for, for single actor, um, specific colors that you want to put together, have everything decanted in here. Uh, you know, a variety of different palettes. This is a Bluebird palette. I've got some lip colors right here. All these will be able to be decanted. Uh, within this, I've also been looking at uh, just sort of Japanese style bento boxes uh, that are in stainless steel. So these are easy to clean and disinfect. Uh, I would actually have these set up. You know, I've got some uh, disposable lip brushes that I could use for glue uh, or product. I've also got q chips that would go in here. And I would have these set up to where. I would be able to pull, this is another bento box that's here. I'd be able to go in with some tweezers and just remove what I need to work with at that time. So I'm not cross contaminating for these. This actually is a removable tray. 
So I can set this down. This can all get soaked in 70% alcohol or whatever my disinfecting solution is. Got some curlers in here. I've got uh, some expendables in the bottom of this one. Nice thing about this one is it's all completely stackable and, uh, and really easy to clean and disinfect. So really you can get a lot inside one of these little containers. Uh, great thing about having it as a cooler is you can also, um, you know, it's going to keep your product cool. So if it's a hot summer day, your makeup is not going to be melting in here. Uh, so you'll get some additional protection to go along with it. But just wanted to show you an example. Like I said, this is a work in progress. I'm still kind of figuring out how I'm going to personally set this up. I just wanted to give you an example of some uses here. Uh, another cool aspect is I actually found some of these art bins here. And if you need, needed to have longer brushes, you didn't necessarily need this little uh, removable tray. These art bins can actually just drop right inside and they fit perfectly. So really very versatile, really easy to use, very well built. Ingalls been building coolers forever, um, uh, very well made. And the great thing is Ingle uh, has um, offered a 25% 25 discount code for anyone that's interested in purchasing any of their coolers. I'm going to post that in the link here. I'll also post Amazon links to all of the bento boxes and all of these little containers that I found on Amazon that seem to fit this box really well. I think the two that I'm going to recommend is the 13 quart and the 19 quart, which is a little bigger, wider, taller. Um, they also have a 30 quart and even larger, but I think uh, those are items that you would want to leave uh, either in the trailer or those are items that you'd want to leave um, in the onset uh, makeup cart, you know, your sanitation cart that would be on set. But I think this is a good size bag. It fits quite a bit of product in it and uh, I'm looking forward to uh, giving this uh, quite a beat down on set coming up soon and seeing how this works. But again, it's easy to put everything in here. It all fits in great, piece together, locks up. You can go in with your 70% alcohol, spray the whole thing down, wipe it all down. At the end of the day, everything can come out of it. All these bins can be cleaned. The inside can easily be cleaned. There's no cloth seams to the bag that you're gonna have to worry if it's been uh, properly cleaned and disinfected or not. So. Um, Ingle Coolers, uh, you can use the uh, discount code FracturedFX and I'll put it in the link here. Thank you very much.